Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. No. <laughs> mm. Mm. All right. Welcome to the Jam Diary. Yes, welcome back. <laughs> we are stoked. Yeah, we are. One of our favorite things. Yes. Double dram blind. Do we know what is in these glasses? We only know that it's whiskey, Peter. Yeah. Let's do it. Okay. Okay. You are such an awesome dork, bro. Thanks, love you too. Thank you. <laughs> okay. I'm not even going to ask what glass we start with. I know it's a... Ooh. Oh. That's nice. That is pleasant. Oh my gosh. Mm. It's like being in a field of wildflowers. Mm. That is so nice. That is very, like, if you had, like, a beautiful spring bouquet drenched in, yes. like, honey. Yes. And I really like that. Wow. And <clears throat> some oak char. Some, like, delicious, wonderful bourbons. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, okay. This one's... It's a, this smells a little weaker. It smells weaker, but, but yeah, I do like the... The big difference between these two, they're not yeah. similar in the least bit. I'm liking that this one's a little, I get, a little dirtier. I was going to say musty yeah, and dirtiness. Yeah, a little on. dirtier, but I like it's it. It's good. Yeah. Is that why you like me? Because I'm dirty? <laughs> <laughs> I'm really dirty. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Okay. Ooh. All right. Off the nose, I'm going to say I prefer glass A. Me too. I'm going to keep them where they're at. <clears throat> okay. Are you so, oh, yeah. Let's, let's take start with the B to the palate. palate. Take B to the palate. Mm. Cool. It's got a lot of... Hard oaky cinnamon yeah, on the finish. Yeah, I was gonna say it's it, there's there's oak. You're not a big fan. <laughs> no, it's good. It's just it's a, it's intense. It's oak forward. Yeah. yeah. This yeah. is our first sip of the night. Yeah. It is tasty. All right, I'm gonna taste this one. Glass A. We're gonna pause it okay. after this, and we'll kind of. Do our thing and then we'll come back. I do want to say that the finish has a little salinity. Are you feeling that? Yeah, actually. Are you getting like a sea salt in the back Now here? that you say that, I'm picking up on that. Yeah. Which, yeah, it does. Yeah. Kind of like some oak. I feel like I can get salinity when I get like musty oaks sometimes. Yeah, maybe. yeah. Yeah. All okay. right. Oh man, this is so nice. Oh. Mm. Hmm. Yeah. I get oak on this too. I do too. Yeah. It's much milder than glass B. Which is strange because the nose was, it was way more, way more um, right. complex. Yeah. Well. <clears throat> well, we're gonna just pause. We're gonna kind of do some back and forth tasting here. Take our mm. notes, and we're gonna come back and let you know. What we thought. Yeah. Okay, we are back. We did our like back and forth tasting, took our notes. Um, okay, so you want to start with glass A? Yeah, let's do it. Okay, glass A. Um, I would pay, I, I would think between 40 and 50 bucks is what it should cost. I wouldn't buy it again, whatever it is. I won't spend my my money on it. That's my opinion. Um, the palette was like very kind of bitter, bitter greens and sugar, and the finish transition just like herbal grassy finish with like green oak it was. Very, I'm, I think this is a rye myself. Yeah. I do. Yeah. I don't know. What What about you for a? Yeah, uh, for me it was just I don't know, the palette was watermelon rind and you know. 
oak wheatgrass. Yeah. Is if this is a rye, not my favorite rye profile. Yeah. But um, yeah. What did you think of B? I to me B was definitely the winner. Like I feel like B drink like a bourbon. Um, I I would be comfortable B paying between sixty and seventy bucks for it. I could see it costing that. Is you know. Okay. I mean, I would like to pay. 55 60 yeah. bucks but i think it's somewhere in the 60 70 dollar range um palette was like vanilla and cinnamon and then faded in some caramel a little bit of funk and like a, it was like a lingering oak that was on the palette lingered on into the finish and kept going on down like that really nice kentucky hug it was warming me and it reminded me of just being on a, in a warm field on a summer eve yeah. that is you know yeah i, I would sip on this one Okay. How about you? Um, it was a little too strong on oak for me. Mm -hmm. um, I got just the tiniest, tiniest bit of molasses. It didn't get very much vanilla, like you, you right. said. But I did get the smallest bit of like salted molasses. <laughs> okay. Um, but again, the oakiness was a little too strong for me. Really? So yeah. I, it was hard for me to pick up on anything outside of that. Yeah. All right. Let's see what they are. Okay. okay, let's do it. Um, was one? Would you pick one over the other, or not really? Yeah, I pick. I think I would pick B over A, just because okay. B has something a little bolder, stronger. And what What would you pay for it? I would not like to pay more than forty five. Okay. For either one of them, to be honest, I, I wouldn't like you said. I wouldn't buy A again, probably. Okay. So, A. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what? No way. What? Were these poured right? Did these get poured right? I don't know if I didn't. Yeah. Are you talking about into it, glasses? Yeah. Yes, I did. Oh my gosh. Knob Creek nine year single barrel, 120 proof. What? That does not make sense. That's crazy. Well, I, I don't know if the bottle is mislabeled, but I did pour them correctly. Yes. Yeah. You just check the bottom of your thing just now. Mm -hmm. A. A, okay. Okay. Now that I saw that's what it is, <laughs> that's why I'm getting on it. Oh, yeah? Like, I'm like, I can see it. Okay. Okay. Weird. Yeah. Just, I wonder if it's like what we had for dinner or what? That's Maybe. bizarre. It could be. Now it's tasting like it. Okay, you ready for B? Yeah. Okay. B is Booker's. Oh. Yeah. The batch, the 2023-04, the Storyteller's Batch. Seven years, two months old, 29 days. 127.8 proof, $100. $100. Yeah. Don't do it, I folks. I don't know. <laughs> I, Typically, we both like the Knob Creek Nine Year Single Barrel. Yeah. I wonder what that's weird. What's going on, man? Huh. Well, there you go. <laughs> um, I, I said I thought this should be between forty and fifty bucks. It's actually for us, it's sixty bucks. Oh. Hmm. Interesting. I guess I'm gonna have to re like revisit what I <laughs> what I really like. Yeah, I am liking the twelve year. I've been drinking that lately. The twelve year. Yeah, is, exactly. I would take the twelve year over this. Okay, man. <laughs> there you go. We're crazy. <laughs> um, I don't know. Have, have if you've done a side by side with a Booker's and a Knob Creek nine year single barrel, let us know yeah. what you thought. If you kind of got like a similar experience as us um when you're doing them blind and it's yeah it, it's a good yeah it's good you know <laughs> all right well maybe this will make you not want to watch us anymore <laughs> but hey it is what it is so yeah thank you all right like if you did like it and if you didn't it probably hurts us but you can put it <laughs> you didn't like it it's okay leave us a comment we, we yeah. do appreciate that yeah. all right until next time.